Okay, bye bye. <laughs> Plan na tapos na yung live stream. Ay, konti lang resources ko. Hello guys! Welcome to my YouTube channel. So, today we will need the basic materials for Shanha's Ascension. It is the Kingsin flowers and the Wooper flowers. So, leveling okay. Shanha from 0 to 30 just needs basic leveling materials. To ascend Shanha from level 40, you will need the Dragon Airs false skin the false skin are dropped by Badis batismal bishops oh no need na to false skin so hunt muna tayo batismal to unlock the batismal bishop you need to do some world quests first so this video doesn't have to walk through all the quests, but I will share the important parts and solving the puzzles. So first, we will start at Sangonomiya Shrine to activate the quest. Just talk to the NPCs until you will be required to find the key sigils. You will have to fight some enemies along the way. Where are you? Then you have to unlock the symbols with the keys obtained.
Hindi ko magana. Ayun, unlock. Then talk to the NPC again until there will be an animation cutscene. Then we have to dive in the center of Hook Me's swimming pool. You will be transported into a cave, so take your time to explore. You will encounter new monsters along the way as you are required to go deeper in the cave. hunt na ba ng ano complete pa dapat complete pa you will be required to search for 5 clues just follow the designation in the map So after you have found the five clues, just follow the quest until you are required to investigate the ruins. To activate this mechanism, I used uh, Shogun skill. I don't know if it has to be electro or any skill will do. Talk to the NPC until you can unlock the new map and you will be required to find the golden birdle. So to get the golden bird though, you just have to activate the triangular uh, so mechanism with an elemental skill again. So first, activate the mechanism that is on the south of the library, then find the second one on the west side of the library and activate it. Okay. Entrance, 
Oh, it's golden bridle, not birdle. <laughs> I'm sorry. Shit. Then you will be required to explore some more and follow Enjo. Try not to fall or else you will respond back to the nearest waypoint. You will reach the point where you will be required to gather fragments. So for the puzzle of Serpent's Heart, Find a way to the center and activate the mechanism. Just follow the part, the pattern in order as shown in this video. And let's go. So just gather the fragments and solve the puzzle. I will show how I show solve the puzzle. Just follow the pattern. So these devices can turn day and night in economia so it can turn to day to night and night to day So we are going to get the last fragment at this map. Let's go. So we have to follow the uh, clues first. There are there will be three clues.
we have another puzzle here just follow what I did you have to move the blocks the block the big block to the center to be able to enter the gate So go deeper into the ruins and you will get the next the last fragment you have to encounter some enemies along the way once you have gathered all the fragments go back to aru note that aru only appears when you set the mechanism into night mode So then the fragments will open the gate to the final trial. So I suggest be prepared for battle for this one. I will not include any spoilers here. But after you have done this quest, you can now fight the Batismal Bishops.
carries them as can be a stay. Too soon to act on it, can we ever?